Hope you boys are ready to become men, because these fiery portobello burgers will do it for you. You really a vegetarian? Yeah. Ever since Margaret left, she was my second wife. Here, use this if you need to heat it up a little. Okay. Mmm. So, Ken Lay. It's not cool going after a dead guy. That's the point, though. He's not dead. What, you got concrete evidence? Yes. No. Well, nothing that'll stick yet, but what we got so far is pretty good. And the body in Ken Lay's autopsy, that was someone else. And also, he was linked to Winchester Tobacco's illegal operations. You know, we should get uh, Gina track down that CEO. See if he can confirm the cigarette. Gina? She's the one with the body by dynamite? <laughs> and she's wasted on guys like you. What do you mean by that? Women don't like this cutesy PC thing you two got going. They like a mean peck of dude who's good with a rifle. You don't see any irony in your vegan burgers and the whole tough guy thing you got going on? Irony? Oh, you're in college, huh? What's your GPA? Talk about the alien stuff. It's good. So another thing we found out in our research, we found out that Ken Lay was also linked to U.S. government alien projects. Linked via some weird program that our guy wrote. Still linked. So what our tuition fees cost these days? This is ridiculous. I picked up an alien once. Our little helpers from Mexico don't count. No. The government lost track of it somewhere outside of Amarillo. And they panicked and called me in. And I found him in a smoke shop in New Mexico. No way. No way. Anyway, they swore me to secrecy. But screw that. There's a guy I worked with back then. He might be able to help you. I gotta use the John. How come you never told me about this alien stuff? It never occurred to me. Hey, if Rita's locked herself in there again, just bang on the door. She'll clear out for you. So you have this guy's number? You've already got it. Sent it by the prison post office. Excuse me? I put in your burger. You should be out of phone tomorrow. That is it. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, come here. Just take it easy. I'm just pushing your buttons. Oh, God. You're a fighter. That's good. Ted's gonna need that soon. What are you talking about? Oh. Well, you know, Ted, he's a nice guy and everything, but it sure is hard to rein in. He's gonna need someone like you, someone tough, someone skeptical. Especially on a job like this. Ted's a little nuts. Oh, a lot nuts. But he's got good instincts. Just keep your eye on him, okay? Yeah. Yeah, thanks. So there's this woman, Sarah. We've been calling for a couple days, no response. Kind of worrying me. I don't like being around her because of the attention we can draw. Um, maybe you could check it out for us. Not a problem. Cool. Um, so you got an email? I'll send the info along. No email. Uh, we'll just have someone bring it by. What are your films? Like 16 millimeter? Yeah, mostly. Hey, what's wrong with your eyes? Uh, nothing. He's been crying. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs>